and welcome to the Oracle Tree Houses vibe reading of the week. This is the week of October 24th through October 30th. I am the Lady of the Tree House, Clairvoyant Intuitive and Reiki Healer, Shanice Jones. Yes, y'all. Yours truly is now a level one Reiki practitioner. So if you would like treatments, healing treatments in person, contact me, purpledove26 at aol.com. All right, yes, I'm kind of a day late according to man time, but I feel like I'm on the universe's time. I'm on time with doing a reading. And yes, this week, y'all, we're going to switch it up. We're doing a new deck. We're working with a new deck deck john holland's psychic tarot oracle card deck so we're gonna work with these this week and see what we get yes today is tuesday october 25th so we're gonna see what's up for the rest of the week we're still gonna do three cards and find out what these new cards have to tell us Oh no! <laughs> that was funny. And it did it anyway. That is funny. Okay. Bear with me, peoples. Alrighty, there we go. Notice this footage is raw, so we are going forth, onward, and forward. Alrighty. We have our three cards up and card for Monday and Tuesday <gasps> harmony yes you know what y'all things are falling into place things are going with it a lot of y'all are listening to the whispers um as most of y'all know I am a Oprah fa Oprah fanatic and yesterday Monday the 24th she had an awesome lesson, lesson 11, listening to your whispers. And when you listen to your whispers, things go into harmony. Things progress right, you know. The, things just flow. And that's what this card right here is, the vibe I'm getting from the card. Um, it's I'm getting the vibe of help from the other side as far as harmony. Um, some of you out there, um, looking at the man and the woman, um, are getting vibes of a harmonious relationship. Now, it doesn't necessarily have to be a romantic relationship. It can be harmonious on a business level. It can also be harmonious on a platonic friend level, also business level. So, yesterday and today, perfect times for harmonious relationships. Alrighty? Mm, excuse me. Let's move forward to Wednesday and Thursday. Wish fulfillment of wishes. This card really feels good. Um, for those of you out here, out there watching, as you know, I'm all about the pro bono, <laughs> not pro bono. Um, the boomerang effect. You know, you throw the boomerang out there and you get it back. So a lot of what y'all have been asking for. You've been believing you're going to receive it, and now it's coming to fruitation. Um, a car, um, some other gifts, things that you are wanting to come to fruitation are coming to fruitation. Um, I'm seeing a peach, so somebody out there in Georgia happening to watch this, things are being fulfilled. Um, if you don't feel like it, if you don't see it, because... This card is drawing, so it doesn't have to necessarily mean material fulfillment for some of you out there. For some of you out there, this is feeling like harmonious fulfillment of relationships, wishes fulfilled, things being done that you've been asking to be done, things of that nature. Um, but the law of attraction, the universe has yielded to you and things will be fulfilled. So... Wonderful Wednesday, awesome Thursday, not to mention that's my birthday, so that's pretty interesting right there. <laughs> Anywho, so Wednesday and Thursday, fulfillment of wishes. And if you don't see it, ask the universe. 
You know what I'm saying? Wednesday, Thursday comes around and be like, okay, what for fish is, wish is fulfilled with Shanice talking about? Ask the universe. Listen to the whispers, y'all. Listen to the whispers, okay? Ask for that um, clarification and confirmation because the universe will definitely give it to you. The universe is definitely talking to you. All right? Let's move forward with the weekend. I love it. I love it. I love it. With the triumph, again, wishes fulfilled, um, overcoming an obstacle, um, overcoming a bridge is what I'm getting, um, making connections, getting your point across is the vibe I'm getting from, oops, there we go, <laughs> the vibe I'm getting for the weekend card, the triumph. The number seven, that is a holy number. That is the number connected to God, unity. So not only are you getting recognized in the earth plane, but you're also getting that recognition on the spiritual plane. And don't be surprised if a relative or a spirit guide makes his presence known to you this weekend. Things are very connected. Things are shifting. Heard the word shifting. Um, as you know, it is Halloween. So, spirit is communicating. That veil is thin. Um, very, very thin. <laughs> and I'm also hearing new beginnings. Definitely connected to Wednesday and Thursday because Wednesday is the new moon. How interesting. New moon and my birthday. Wow. <laughs> totally crazy. So if we step back and look at the spread for this week, it's a pretty harmonious spread. You know what I'm saying? Ask and it is giving. I'm feeling like wishes are being fulfilled. Relationships are being forged. People are moving forward. I'm, I'm loving it. And again, like I said, y'all, if you're not seeing it, ask the universe. Talk to your God. Be like, yo, um... It looks in the internal, the external of things are looking negative universe. Can you please show me some good? That's all you got to do is ask. Don't take this external equivalent of your future. This is just what things look like now. You still have the blueprint. You still have the unseen force. You can create it any way you want to. But once you've created, you got to listen to the whispers to help bring it to the earth plane. Alrighty, that is the reading for, the vibe reading for the week of October 24th through the 30th. Y'all check me out today on Blog Talk Radio. Gonna have an awesome guest. She called in on the last show and it was so awesome. She's coming back to do readings. Queen Yoko, I'm sorry, Queen Yokis Ra, BTR's host. She has her own radio show. She will be on the show. Check me out, 3 p.m. Eastern. 12 Pacific two hour show we'll be talking about her awesome project she's an artist, she's a medical intuitive she's also an author talk about her projects we're going to be doing readings also to y'all I'm still at live person, I'm still at king.com also to y'all if you're in the Norfolk, Virginia Beach Severn City area, come by Kindred Spirit, I'm there at Kindred Spirit now, Mondays Thursdays and Saturdays So come and check me out if you would love an in-person reading. If not, hit me up on the phones and on email at livepersonandkeen.com. Until then, I will talk to y'all next week. Love ya. Bye.